And we're back. Uh, yeah. Going up against goblins as Mordor is not my cup of tea. And as I said, I'm not the best at this, so, like, I don't want to make my life idiot easier, harder by coming across another spammy evil faction. Make yourself useful. We're up against men again. Gondor are a good faction, but uh, they're not fun to verse. <laughs> but yeah, really enjoyed point oh nine, version nine, I should say. Yeah, I don't really have a pattern when it comes to building placement. But, uh, goblins attacked me in the first minute, so... Alright. Orcs near Gothmog gain 25% damage, 25% armor, and an experience 50% faster. Oh god. Uh, we'll have a look at the tavern first, because that seems to be a big change. Always, always build your ego at the back if you can. Yeah, I love Mordor. I love and hate Mordor. Is there walls? No, there's not. What's in this new tavern? I thought... I honestly thought... They had... Walls. Apparently I was wrong. Get the banner areas. I've had a few people ask me about uh, why does my game look different. And it's because I have the Biffin 2 HD edition. There's so much trees around. Oh, early calf. Early calf's the worst. Right, destroy that. Taking the builder's cart. So, yeah, we haven't got walls. Which sucks. Absolute donkey's asshole. Mordor. 
At least their fortress is uh, absolutely tanky as shit. I think this is East End man. I'm not sure dude. God, he levels up fast. Allies near Gothamog gain immunity to fear and terror. Uh, so what's the tavern? Pause it while I read. Uh, tavern makes a return to Mordor's build originally available in Biff Me 2. Corsair is available from level 1. Fire Arrow is available from level 2. Forge Blaze and Heavy Armor available from level 3. Building multiple taverns allows discount from Corsairs. Build costs 350, level 2 costs 500, level 3 costs 3750. Are they 880? I feel like that's been changed. Yeah, this is is Mnet. Got Goth mod upgrades. Fucking quickly. I feel like they're gonna flank me at some point. 500 for a mountain troll. Or the rocks. They're going to go for that. Mordor are great though, they have like some of the strongest siege in the game. But yeah, apparently walls were removed. I'm not a hundred percent sure about that. Mimi kill cost reduced to fourteen hundred. When we kill Pen, costs reduced to 600. Uh, benefits increased to 250 from 150. Health. Health, not benefits. Firebombs can no longer be toggled instead of target poly ability with 45 second cooldown. Ah! That's a bit, that's a bit nicer. Troll's going to die. Alright, let's put you on aggressive. Troll's still kicking, which is amazing. Uh, look at that. I see. Yeah, hard build quick. Uh, you take them out. Towers galore, mate. Tavern. 
we get fire arrows. I do wish the radius for farms was less shit. I know Brutal get a tiny radius and that's why they, their resources are so fucking overkill. Ooh, 600. Oh. Oh, fuck. Where's my archers? Right, we got 10 again, and we'll get that because we want the resources. Garrison Towers? That is absolute horse shit. I'd rather shit in my hands and clap. Sworn. Maybe it's in Santa Bit Me too. That um, you get walls. I could be wrong. Though. Biffing one too much, I keep fucking up the Alright. 
killed him. Alright, get that. No one's gonna stop us. I didn't know normal orcs could get upgrades. I never used to be able to. Paradrum Spearman. So much money, it's ridiculous. I want the Witch King. The Witch King's got some additions. Witch King first armor decreased to 20%. Siege works. Build cost reduced to 300. Crikey. That's um, that's a big discount. That's a, that's a heckin' good discount. I don't think I have builders. Sending in. I missed. Right, we need towers on that side. Doing well for himself. I really need a witch king. What else have they got? Orc warriors. Reverted the 5% bonus weapon damage. Attack speed increased. Uh, Forge Blades upgrades damage increased to 40 from was 60. Orc Archer's Shroud Clearing Range increased to 400. We lost the building. trees around no this is a rather treeless map god mordor is so OP 
you know what you're doing. Allegiance. I don't think we'll need it on this map. I never bother with fell beasts, they die very easily. being decreased. Alright, what else have we got? Black Orcs. First, Frost unupgraded armor grease 100% from 140. Decreased, I should say. Oh. God, they've already got 15 power points. Then again, so do I. Ah, uh, no. Witch King, thank you very much. Mobile Sorcery. Alright, what else have we got? Balthus Sauron, now tier 2 hero. Command points re uh, required, reduced to 60. Recruit and redive time reduced accordingly. Experience rewards and requirements reduced accordingly. That's good. I thought he was um. Here comes the siege fam. I hate speech siege spam, it's absolute bollocks. Witch King, first armored decrease to 220%, fell beast first armor decrease to 20%, uh, son of a gun. 
Destroyed my towers. Your ass is mine. Sixteen. All right. I love. Being evil. Say rats. Oh, Witch King is a lot more powerful. Take over that. I like the her room. Where are you? What the fuck are you doing? Another building. The enemy. Which king comes first? Okay. Interesting. 
Here we go. Get the one they're waking. If no heroes and you can't revive the Witch King, I oh, know you can. Couldn't do it before. This is unfortunate. are great. Have we always struggled as Mordor? Like, alright, so what else have we got? Um, Mouth of Sauron, yeah, we did him. Uh, Drummer Troll, health increased to 2,500. 2, Pierce Armor just Decreased to 40%. Fortress Gorgoroth spy minimum attack range increased to 200. Interesting. You need siege when you have attack trolls. My catapults. The building is fired for more. All right. We can always get the second tier four. Thank 
your shit show. Make it full. Second wave of units. Alright. It's extra time. time. My phone. It stinks. everyone up to kingdom come the enemy is on us. I saying, when they lose a fortress they generally build a tower in its place Oh, whatever. This place belongs to the enemy. They're attacking. Scrap some plunder. Scrap some plunder. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, I'll see you next time, and goodbye for now. Welcome to the end of the video, shout out to my lovely patrons, you keep the stream alive, even a dollar per month is a lot of help and it goes a really long way. And thank you all for essentially getting me to this point, we've recently passed 500 subscribers, woo. And yeah, this is, so I'm making a new outro. So we have a few Discord servers here we would like to show off um this is my private patreon discord server if you're a patreon you get access to this depending on your level but um even one dollar a month you get that access to most stuff just like uh we've got videos youtube playlists beyond the scenes which i just like generally drop stuff all the time like nice beyond the scenes stuff and uh, we've got our main server here and um, once again, links to pretty much everything, co-owned with Nadaline. So we've got news, wall mod content, other game content. Pretty much a bit of everything for everyone. And don't and forget to go look at my social media. I'm very active on all of them. There should be some screenshots popping up, but yeah, go check them out. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Goodbye for now.
Hey, I just thought I would add to my outro and say I now have a Biffy English community set up. Um, and I thought I would show it off because I've been linking in the description, but yeah. So we've got like Biff Me Mod News, uh, content promotion of like YouTubers that play Biff Me, general game news, and yeah, we're still just getting sort of used to everything. Uh, and yeah, check the links below and you'll see it. Right, thank you.